Bellator MMA live on Spike tonight from Southern California's Pechanga Resort Casino. Let's get right to it with a fight in the welterweight division. Mario Jaromskis versus Fernando Gonzalez. This is what the entire fight looked like. A fight in a phone booth, both guys standing toe-to-toe -to -toe, trading punches. Who was at Fernando Gonzalez's boxing ring, throwing combinations, actually set a welterweight record for strikes landed. And he wins a unanimous decision victory. Up next, light heavyweights in a rematch. Houston Alexander taking on Virgil Zwicker. Houston Alexander getting the takedown in the first round and staying on top, but Virgil Zwicker in rounds two and three, able to keep the fight mostly on the feet where he landed some good shots with the right hand. Trying to catch Houston Alexander with the uppercut like he did here, hurt him more than once. Houston Alexander trying to finish strong. Virgil Zwicker throwing with a bandit at the end of the fight to try and leave an impression with the judges. He's rewarded with a split decision victory. On then to the featherweight division and two of Bellator's best at 145, Georgie Karahanian facing Bubba Jenkins. Would it be the experience and submission ability of Georgie Karahanian or the athleticism and wrestling of Bubba Jenkins? That question was answered in the first round when Georgie Karahanian locked up this beautiful guillotine choke that put Bubba Jenkins to sleep in the first round. And finally tonight, our main event for Bellator's featherweight world title, the former champion Daniel Strauss facing the reigning champion Patricio Pitbull. Daniel Strauss, a couple fouls to the cup early cost him a point, but he looked outstanding on the feet, not going for as much of the wrestling as we expected, sticking to his kickboxing where he landed sharp combinations throughout this fight, kicks as well, changing it up, mixing in the occasional takedown against Pitbull. Look at this beautiful straight left that put Pitbull on his butt, but a mistake in the fourth round cost Daniel Strauss this fight. Going for a Kimura on the ground without guard. Look at this, Pitbull stepping over, taking the back and getting the rear naked choke finish to defend his belt in round number four. For the latest Bellator news and information, it's Bellator.com. This February, Bellator MMA brings the power. He's done. He's out cold. February 13th at Schlomenko versus Manhall. Good night. In February 27th, the British invade. Doug Lima versus Paul Daly. Emmanuel Newton versus Liam McGeary. Plus Michael Venom Page. Bellator MMA, this February, live and free on Spike.